In this tutorial, I want to show you this really cool effect called the sensor effect. As you can see right here, I have just blurred out my face as like a little sensor effect. Now you may have seen in videos, let's say someone reveals your address or someone doesn't want their uh, face shown, the editor has to censor or blur out that specific piece of information. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can actually use this really cool sensor effect and a whole bunch of different options you have with this effect. Now this effect is plug-in free, so there is no plug-in for this effect. So let's go ahead and just uncheck the sensor effect, and this is just an old video of mine to show you how to use this effect. So you want to head over to here, head over to the effects panel, then what you want to do is you want to click on all. Once you're in all, you want to head down to the search bar and just type in sensor. You don't have to type in anything else, just type in sensor and take the effect and drag it on to your video. Now this is where you can have a lot of fun with it. No, I just put it on the entire video, but it just depends on what you're trying to do. Now as you can see right here, here is a sensor effect. So wherever I drag it, the effect as it then as the name says it's censoring it out so my face over here wherever I want I can just uh, censor it so let's put it on my face right here and show you a whole bunch of things you can do um, with this effect so the first thing which it should be pretty obvious is the amount so as you can see you can turn it all the way down and there you go the sensor effect is completely gone or you can just turn it up so this just depends on how much of the sensor effect you actually want. Now a couple of options here is method. You can switch it to blur, you can switch it to darken, or you can also switch it to the rectangle effect and the same thing applies. You can just uh, move it all around. A couple of the things you can do is with the radius. So for example, let's say I put it over my face and I'll switch it back over to the pixelate effect. As you can see, I can increase the radius so I can have pretty much the entire video can be completely all censored or I can get it really dialed in on a certain thing. So let's say for example, this is like the address of a home. I'll put it over here and the person says, oh, I need you to blur the address. Put it over here, take the radius. And once it's pretty much covered everything, there you go. You won't be able to, to see the address, the amount is all the way up, and the radius is all, it's just basically covering wherever you want. So let's say this flower thing was also something I need to be blurred. I'll just go ahead and blur it right here. And there you go. This is this very simple and easy uh, sensor effect. There's a whole bunch of different things you can do. You can mess with the center. You can mess with the aspect ratio. You could invert it. There's a whole bunch of different things you could do with this effect. But hopefully you found this tutorial helpful and now you know where to find the sensor effect. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Once I reach 1000 subscribers, I'll be giving away a Google Home Mini. I upload Final Cut Pro tutorials almost every single day, but at least I'll upload at least 4 or 5 every single week. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. See you guys in the next one. Peace.